Welcome everybody. I am Zandrio, and I'm going to start a new game today. A new game called Trine 2. Once upon a time, there were three valiant heroes chosen by a magical artifact called the Trine. You may have heard another tale of how they met. Let me tell you a story of their latest adventure. Something mysterious and magical was taking place in the forest. First of the three heroes was Amadeus, a wizard. Not perhaps the bravest or the most powerful, but he was clever and sensible. Then there was Pontius the knight, fearless protector of the realm, who loved good food, drink and battle. Last but not least was Zoya, a thief. An entrepreneur. An entrepreneur. She was mysterious and only seen as a passing shadow on a cloudy night. Okay, so there's the little intro story. Amadeus the wizard was asleep in his cottage. It was a place where he could study his fireball spell hidden from the scornful eye of his wife. Oh my goodness. Alright, now I've played Trine 1 when it first came uh, out. I've really enjoyed that game. Turn it off. I'm sleeping here. What is it? Who's there? Okay. I can control my guy. This game has very, very beautiful visuals, as you can see. I've played this game a little bit. Uh, How very strange. I've got past a few levels, but I'm just starting it over here for the for the let's play. Very interesting platformer. It's physics based. The mage is interesting. The he can conjure boxes. But this wouldn't stop the great wizard Amadeus. With his magic, he could lift objects. And you can lift things up. Now, I gotta get these little gear thingies. And I think at the start I can only create one box. So let's Oh, I'm 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 horrible at this game apparently. Because I'm just jumping up and down and doing nothing. Anyways. The mage can levitate things. In trying one he had a mana bar. Which was actually really annoying because Amadeus he was could also conjure boxes out of thin air. It was annoying in Trine One because he was constantly running out of mana, and you couldn't really get a lot done with him. But there being no mana here, you can just conjure to your heart's content. And the mage is actually my favorite of the three classes. The light moves through the forest leading Amadeus further. Torn between fear and wonder, he followed. We'll just make a box here and... Oh, oh! Let's try that again. That's more like it. Ah, crap. So you have the mage, then you have a knight who has a sword and shield. And then you have the the thief, which is pretty fun to play. She's got a bow. I demand to know what's happening. The trine. Not this again. <gasps> and there's the knight. Pontius. Amadeus, get your things. We need to save the kingdom. What? Oh, this won't do at all, Pontius. I've children waiting for me to come home. I can't leave. But your magics are needed. The kingdom is in danger. <sighs> Will this nightmare ever be over? 
Despite his reluctance, Amadeus knew that the heroes were needed once more. How did you end up here? Let me tell you. Oh, now we get to hear the nice Pontius story. Pontius had headed out that evening, for there was trouble on the peasant farms. Oh, that Creeping is beautiful. vines were taking over the fields. Hmm. A warlock must be behind this devilry. I'll find him and teach him a lesson with my sword. So the knight's cool. He's got a sword. He's also got a hammer, which you can pound the ground with. When he's got a sword and shield, you can right-click and aim this shield anywhere to block. With luck. There'll be pumpkin pie for dinner tonight. Pontius searched the farm, but saw no one there. Hmm. The nasties must have fled at the sight of me. Whoa, now. Okay. Now, with this hammer, I can bust these rocks. Uh oh, that looks dangerous. And I can block things from falling on my head. The knight is actually the, the best one for just straight up combat. You can just get right up in people's faces and just Be lasted, not die from I'll it. Show you what for. I'm Pontius the Brave, and I won't fall in a battle with dandelions. He does look to be getting a little overwhelmed here. The trine! Pontius had never understood what exactly the trine did, but he knew that the artifact was there to help. And so Pontius felt happy. He couldn't think of a better quest than saving his kingdom. Late that night, Zoya was concealed in the shadows, hidden from the shimmering moonlight. Now the thief is cool. You got your bow, which you can just aim like this, and your grappling hook. You can just grab stuff and swing with. Just shoot that rock. Shoot the rope and drop the rock here. Alright, now I should be able to grapple this. And jump up to here. Yeah. Oh, I'm falling in holes. She's the most agile of all of them. Zoya passed through the town as quietly as a whisper. I gotta swing on my grapple here. There we go. Then she saw a glimmering light moving on top of the old church. Hmm. Oh. Where am I supposed to go here? Ah, here we go. Hey, I thought I could grapple onto that. Not sure why I can't. There we go. The trine. How inconvenient. What are you doing here in the middle of the night? Not back to your old tricks and thievery. <laughs> oh, there's a perfectly good explanation for this. Tell me, where are we going? We don't really know yet. Something strange is going on. A new venture. Shall we go then? Okay, so that's the so intro the level done. had come for the heroes, and the adventure was ready to begin. Amadeus worried for his family, while Pontius looked forward to their new quest. Zoya, of course, imagined what fabulous treasure they might find.
Let the adventure begin! Where are we? Where did the trine bring us? Let's take a look around to find out. Okay. So now we can switch between our characters at will. I enjoy the uh, wizard for some reason. Wizard is just my favorite of all of them. But I just fell in the spikes because I suck. But we'll we'll just use her because she can move around real easy. The thief is the thief is nice for getting some places. The wizard is the wizard is good for that later in the game when you can summon multiple boxes and uh, platforms and whatnot. I'm not sure what other things they've added in trying to. I'm assuming there's probably probably a little bit more stuff you can do. Which I could probably look in the skill trees. Now I don't have the expansion, so there's a couple things here I can't get. But most likely I'll just end up focusing on the wizard first off. Come on, climb up there. Wait, that's a that's a that's a thing to get right there, isn't it? How come I can't get it? Oh, it's behind behind the wood. Oh, there we go. You can break it with the knife. So you got to use all three of the guys, all three of your tunes here to properly navigate this place. I should be able to build a floating box and jump on it. And then except I'm horrible at this game apparently. Let's just go like so and maybe I can make it up. Nope. Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> Oh, I am failing miserably. Oh, this is this is quite embarrassing. I'm I'm trying to get this one little doodad up here. I got it. Okay. Now, is this something we hit with our knight? Okay, there we go. We got a bunch more doodads way the hell up there. How do we go about getting those? Well, let's just go like so. Let's get our wizard out. We'll weigh this sucker down. Now that water should flow and grow this plant. Mm. Yes. This water is really powerful. I ought to see if it works on potatoes as well. <laughs> the knight wants to see if the water works on potatoes. He thinks that would be awesome. Here we go. We'll just grab those things. Now, I should make this water run this way, and it should make a nice little plant grow up over so I can get these things. Just simple little puzzles in this first level. All right, I need to extend this leaf out, water this next plant. Perfect. Now, I should be able to jump and get that one. Okay, I have leveled up. So all those little jars give you experience, which you can then spend on your skills. I have one skill point. It takes two skill points in order to get a second conjured item. Two skill points to be able to conjure a plank. So I'm just going to wait till I have more skill points because I want to upgrade my wizard's abilities. Oh, and I just fell in the spikes. What do we got here? Oh, rock falling. Yeah, I see something up here. I guess I gotta get out my hammer. Right, 
we'll just get Zoya out here so we can get up on top easily. She's good at that. Intruders. Do you think we'll have okay. to fight them? I think maybe Get I'm going to have something stick. to fight here we in just a second. The big fat one. Attack. <gasps> goblins. Oh, Charge. goblins. Um, okay, let's just shoot him with my bow. All right, switch switch to the guy that can fight. And I just timed that wrong. Let him hit and then attack him. There we go. Is this what we're here for? Slaying goblins? A simple, straightforward quest. I like it. I don't. Perfect. The mage can actually, um... He, he doesn't have a weapon, but you can conjure a box and actually drop it on top of an enemy and it will kill the enemy. So he does have some some ability to hurt things. And I want to get up and get these. And a trick the mage can do is stick things onto these spikes. And I can't quite jump, so let's just make a little mid-air box to jump off of. And we'll just build another box and stick it in those spikes. Oops! There we go. Oh, getting hit by spikes. But I should be able to... I should be able to conjure a box up here and use it to push this off. Perfect. All right. Oh, those things will hurt me. So let's just switch to my knight. They can't hit the shield. Oh, there's stuff up there. I need to get up to the top. So we'll just switch to her. And I can grapple up here. And then we'll build a little mid-air box. We've got a treasure chest. I found this collectible painting. As I said before, I've, I played through a few of... I, I played through a little bit of this game Whoa. I played through a little bit of this game, uh, it's been a few months ago actually, I, I bought this game, played through a bit of it, and I have not come back to it till now. I'm not sure why, I, I really enjoy it, it's a fun game, just got involved in other things for some reason. But I think I'll play through the entire thing on this, on my channel here, and uh... See where we can go with it. Kind of stuck down here. There we go. Right, I need a box to stand on. I'm not tall enough. Let's jump on this rock. Oh, getting attacked. Oh! Alright, let's drop a box on him. Smash! Right, I need to switch to a different guy. Wizard just doesn't cut it. Does not cut it. When he gets planks, it's a little easier to fight with the wizard. He just doesn't cut it at the start of the game, I'm afraid. Right, we'll just use our archer to deal with this guy. That wasn't no big deal. Okay, what did I miss? I 
I see stuff up here. I should be able to just... Yes. There's a heart. I think that just heals me, and I didn't really need it. I wasn't hurt. Guess it doesn't hurt to just get it, though. Oh, there is something up here. Let's see, can I use my wizard and... Oh, I can. I can aim this thing. Oh, that's cool. Let's just aim it the other direction. That's really very cool. I like that. Let's see if we can get up here. I'm going to have to build another box. Jump on it. Oops. Let's try this again. Hey, box! Stay there. Another box. Uh, Alright, well, I got the one. But I see more stuff up there, and I'm sometimes I'm like my ADD kicks in, and I I just have to I just have to gra I I have to get stuff if I see it. Really frustrates me if I can't get it. All right, come on. I'm I'm being an idiot. All I need to do is make a box, stick it in the spikes. No, I need a second. I need to be able to conjure a second object, is what I need. Is there anything to grab up here? Alright. Well, I know I can do this this way. Let's just make a proper box. <sighs> you idiot! Worthless mage! Don't you know how to jump? Oh, lord! Ah, uh, that sucked. Alright, I know I can do this. Stop falling off. Here we go. Uh, stupid! Yeah, it's frustrating me. Just move these boxes a little bit. Can I lift this bottom box while I'm on the top one? No. You could do that in try and one. There. Well, what the hell? Ah! Good lord, dude! Dropping big ass boxes on my head, or rocks on my head. This is wrong. Okay, I've leveled up. Let's make this so I can conjure two items. That's what I really want. That'll be extremely helpful. Now I have a feeling I missed something down there. Damn it. This is where I was supposed to go in the long run. And I missed what's behind here. And there's more stuff back here. Well, how do I get it? Oh, that's how I get it. Oh, good lord. There's more stuff down here? Which way is the secret way, and which way was I supposed to go first? Okay, this is the secret way, because it's an end. Oh, looky there. That just made me an elevator. Maybe it wasn't a secret thing after all. Go away. All right. Now we can move on. Ah, oh, that was spikes. Don't fall in the spikes. Let's get this rock out of my way. Whoa! Bouncy mushrooms. All right, what's up here? Is there something I can grapple? 
Oh, there's some stuff. Got bubbles I can ride. Well, that guy was just quite the wuss, wasn't he? Oh, this bubble is going to pop. So I've got to I've got to push the bubble like so. And then jump on the bubble. And it doesn't get popped on the spikes. Go away helping helping keyboard thing. It's a nursery rhyme. Oh, I have found a nursery My rhyme. My sister is beautiful, charming and bold. I love her so much. We are 8 years old. Alright, I'd like to I'd like to complete this first level in, in this playthrough. I can't imagine there's that much more in it. That's a funny looking rock. Why? It's a huge snail. Enjoying a shower. Oops. Let's let's just try again here, shall we? That's more like it. Okay, I have got to water this plant, so let's make let's make a little box over here. And let's pull the water down to this side. Maybe it'll bounce off that box. Uh, it's not far enough. That's not working. So build a box up here to weigh it down. And then let's get a little angle on this box still not far enough is there anything else I can use oh here's something that's more like it wonderful lettuce for the snail there she goes <laughs> she has a healthy appetite that one What's that? Ooh, whatever what do we it was, have I'm here? glad it went the other way. How the hell do I get rid of this thing on my screen? It's really annoying me. Target and then press. Come on, go away. That that little tip there is pissing me off that it's just sticking on my screen. Drop a box on that thing's head. Okay. See another thing up here. And there's there's a thing on it. I need to get that. Smash him with boxes. Right, we'll throw these boxes away. What does this lever do? Oh, that lever doesn't stay up very long. Alright, I should be able to knock that thing off of up there. If I can get a place to stand up here somewhere... Nothing. All right, knock it off. Come on, get off there. Get off. Oh, it's not. It's not actually sitting on there. Well, that's. Oh, wait a minute. I got this thing bouncing on this. That worked. Okay. Now we'll just go like so. Let's make a box and wedge it under there. Ah, damn it. Come on. Build another box. Wedge it under there. Yes, wedge it under there. Just like that. We'll get these couple things. 
Oh, there's another one. Okay. Oh, I see something else up here. Alright, we'll just drop this giant stone on these goblins. They're not gonna like that. Smash him! Smash him! Smash the goblins! Hell yeah! Alright, just switch to the knight. Kill these guys. Don't waste time. Let's make us a make us a little box to get this. There we go. He's kicking at me. Oh, what a jerk! Alright, well that rolls. I'm not sure what, what good that does me right now. Let's just grapple grapple my ass up here. Damn it, now I need it to come back. I need to ride this thing. Alright, I've got to somehow get... Do those boxes not die? Okay, the boxes don't die. I've got to be getting close to the end of this first level. I'm, I've been I've been going at it for quite a while here. I want to I want to end this level before I before I end this episode. And I know I'm just right near the end. All right, goblins. So train one. Pretty much everything he fought was a skeleton. So far in trying to, it's nothing but goblins. Good little battle going on here. Oh, I've leveled up again. Alright, let's get out my archer and shoot that guy through the crack. Headshot. I can't grapple that. Well, damn it! How do I get up here? Just make, just make boxes. I don't know what my problem is. All right, I have two more skill points. Let's get the plank. Hell yeah, I can make a plank now. Planks are planks are badass for killing enemies. You can just easily draw a plank above their head. Ah, there we go. And we'll just draw a plank across here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah! Good gravy. Alright, I'm stuck in a hole. Let's get the hell out of here. I'll ride this thing. Now, I missed out on one experience thing over here. I saw it right there. There it is. No problem. Is that the wind blowing? No. Okay, I it's should be able to ride this pulse. airflow. Let's get out my wizard and Okay, we can we can move this thing around. Oh, there's a damn plant over the top of it. Stupid thing. There we go. I want to get all those. That makes that float. Oh, that works just fine. Go away. That damn tip on my screen is really bothering me. It comes up every time I switch to the wizard, and it's really frustrating me. Oh, what a jolly looking place. All right, now we're getting somewhere. Look at the size of that oh, thing! Oh Lord! It's monstrous. We have got a boss. 
Ooh, that looks scary. All right, how do I beat this guy? What must I do? Die, goblin. Let's climb up here. As far as I can go. Whoa! Okay. Now, that was fun. Oh, he just killed my knight. I can get him back. Not too big a deal. Game is pretty forgiving. You just run back to a, a checkpoint and you're fine. How the hell do I how do I kill this thing? I dropped a big rock on its head last time. I'm not sure what caused that to happen though. I really don't want him striking me. Drop a plank on him? Planks on his head! I'm not sure if I'm actually accomplishing anything here. I have a feeling I'm probably not. Let's just shoot this thing above his head. See if we can drop another rock on his head. Ow. Ow. Die. Okay. Obviously I don't know what the hell I'm doing here. What am I supposed to do? How do I fight this guy? Let's climb back up here. Alright, strike me! Oh, you gotta make him strike and then dodge it. Okay. Gargantuan snakes and giant snails. Whatever next? Huge grilled pork, I hope. <laughs> Who are these strange people? I better keep my eye on them. The trine had brought our heroes to a strange forest where they had encountered goblins and enormous creatures. After facing the perils of the forlorn ruins, they came to a great big steaming swamp. However, they were unaware that someone was now following their journey with great interest. I wonder what goblins eat. They eat people like you. Oh dear. Okay, so we have beat the first little chapter there. Fought a nasty big snake, and we have learned that there is somebody watching us. So, I think I'm going to end the episode here. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.